hello everybody welcome to my youtube channel it's your girl peshwari again in case you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe hit that notification bell share comment and welcome so in today's video we are going to visit this young mom over here she is a young mom of two kids and also she is expecting uh, she is expecting uh, the third born. So as you can see, she is very weak. The reason behind, she just came out from hospital. She wasn't feeling well. She was hospitalized for some weeks. So after that, she is just very weak. and But she has kids that are looking towards uh, for her to feed them so she has to try and do something for the kids as you can see her kids are very young also she has very young kids as you can see she is trying to do all the house chores despite her condition despite her not feeling well But now she has a problem that she can't go to do uh, heavy jobs like go to farming to find some jobs so that she can be able to feed the kids. So what she does, she struggles and all she feeds the kids are these greens over here. She just cuts some and boil them and feed the kids. So today when I visited her, I met her boiling these greens without nothing else. And she had cooked a, a white porridge without sugar, without nothing, just a white porridge for the kids. That what she, they had a, taken for breakfast. So she is really struggling to feed this young kids over here so i just decided to visit her and give her a supplies i just wanted to share something ritual with her as i know she can't be able to work because uh, actually she was given a bed rest but uh, due to the condition that she is the one providing for this kid she can't uh, go for bed rest so she has to try and feed these young kids because they, at the end of the day, they will ask for food from their mom. As you can see, the young kid is trying to try and see if she can if he can get something to eat in this sophoria you can see the young boy is struggling to find something to eat because he is already hungry and their mom doesn't have anything to give them she's just trying to boil those greens so that the kids won't play just to give them hope there is food you can see she is a very young mom she is very 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 young but weak because of her condition and the health condition so this is what they do she just had this one cup of porridge white porridge with no sugar so they share the cup of porridge in three you can just imagine one cup shared by three people it's not even enough but that's all they had so they had to share it 
you can see the young kids they are very happy because they were hungry so their mom just uh, decided to give them uh, that porridge for us as you can see they just want to zip and it's finished You can just imagine at her condition that uh, staying without food. She just feel. She said she feels some um, dizziness at that time. She feels weak because of no food. You can see how the kids are trying to clean the porridge at in the crate because it wasn't enough for them. You can see they are really trying. Oh my god. The boy just need bow but they are it's finished. You can see the bow is trying. So I just decided to give them something ritual for their supper and the mom was very happy. She was thanking me and praying for me to get more. So at least I gave them something that they can eat supper and lunch time. And the baby boy was very happy, but she wanted he wanted something too. She has an adorable kiss. So guys, in my life, I just feel happy when I try to share something with those people who don't have. It's it's good we try to help and share what we have this young mom you can see she can't go to work at her condition because she is not employed she just have to go and hustle trying to wash clothes for people and go digging